time for the last in the present series of Jackson Pace and they've found their way to the steps of the temple. The Temple of Kinar, this way. Oh. Oh. Jackson! Temple of Kinar, this way. Ow! Please. For Sophie's sake, man. Well, I've got to go. This is a monument to the gods of a public lavatory outside Hammersmith Broadway. Show some respect, man. Thank you. This task. The sacred keystones, Jackson. Thank you, Miss Tusk. This is a moment of historical importance. A moment of... Jackson. Yes. Can I have a moment of privacy? I'm bursting. So am I, Wibbly, but with excitement. Yeah, but burst excitement don't leave a nasty puddle stain. Wibbly! Thank you. First. Second keystone. Guarded by the lost tribe of Tupata, Jackson Pace will not succeed. I'll just know! Princess Lamy! Hello! Oh, how are you? How are you feeling? What do you mean? How am I? I'm up to my neck in quicksand. How do you think I'm feeling? Oh, a bit icky. Get me out of here! The third keystone. In 
intruders. with us. Apart from the time we had that competition in the showers at public school, this is probably the greatest moment of my life. Jackson! Oh, Wibbly! Jackson! Wibbly! Oh, this does! For his sake, Wibbly, you're an Englishman. Try and behave like one. Richard, what danger lurk? I know danger lurks. I'd like to put up with Insect bites, jungle fights. Not to mention the rather dubious attentions of Lord Latar's wandering hands. He's wandering what? I never once. I'd fight any man who'd interfered with Princess Lamy. Yeah, she'd be fighting an army, mate. Will you two just shut up? We mustn't give ourselves away. We must remain absolutely silent. What was that? Sounded like the hideous squealing of a grotesquely overweight jungle beast. Jake! Let me, Adam. I'll, I'll, I'll tear him limb from the Allow the fools their moment of glory. The Guardian will soon put a stop to that. The what? The Guardian. He feeds on intruders, filling his belly with, the, with their flesh and his veins with their blood. Uh, what do you do with all the other stuff? Well, how should I know? Probably makes a stew or something. Or a casserole. Oh, no, 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 you wouldn't have the spices for a casserole. Oh, yes, but you see, if you... Look, for God's sake, will you two just belt up? Two old men. Come on. It's a bit ratatouille. says we must obtain the key to the sacred treasure chamber, and apparently the key hangs from the neck of somebody called... The Guardian. Thank you. The Guardian. Oh, well done, Jackson. Thank you, Mr. Tusk. Hang about, hang about, hang about. I worked it out as well. Shh. No, not shush, no. Ah, if you're so smart at translating hieroglyphics, yeah, do that one. That one there, go on. Go on. Oh, very well, Ripley. <coughs> Be worried. The Rialu Lilalu Hevali Flavoud. Very good, Jackson. Thank you, Miss Tusk. What does it mean? Rubbish. I'm the clever one. I'll do it. I'll work it out. Here, look. Beware the really heavy falling rock. Beware the really heavy falling rock. Oh! Are you all right, Mr. Wibley? It's only a minor setback, Miss Tusk. Ah! Setback-wise, I'd say we're talking major. Tally home with me. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Oi, Guardian! It's me, Princess Lamy. You, I'm here. We must keep caution, Miss. Halfway around the world to heed the words of a. <sighs> oh, stuff this for luck. Let's go ahead. I have been expecting you, mistress. Oh, yes. Oh, I've burst it. Sammy, save everything. Not now. This. 
way. I say, a woman from the village. I need some new togs. You, you better get out. I shall not. I say, Pacey. Hello, Wibbert. <laughs> I say, that Wibbert, look, she's got bouncy bobbly boobies. <laughs> Fear not. Pace and his associates are being dealt with. Besides, they can do nothing without this key. But do not underestimate him. At this very moment, he's probably devising some ingenious, cunning plan. Let's pull her knickers down. Let's, Let's pull her knickers down. Will you shush? I'm trying to concentrate. <sighs> ah, yes, I see. It's a simple reverse process into the water. No, we shall not. Look, I just about had it up to here with you two. That's the way. You're about to see bubbly, busy me. <laughs> Shut up. Ah! Now, little boy, are you going to get back in or are you going to get a smack? I'll get back in. Ah, what was that for? Fun. <laughs> ah! Sacrifice! Ah! Sacrifice! Ah! <laughs> I say, Miss Task! Savage sake, where's that confounded one? There, yes. How do you know? The fountain of youth! <laughs> yes. I really think we should go. I just have. And for Savage sake, man, surely not. Let's find Miss Task! <sighs> Not far now, mistress, and the treasure shall... What the... What is going on here? Sacrifice. Ah, yes. Would you care to watch, mistress? Well, I don't know. It depends how gory, grisly and bloody it gets. Oh, pretty horrible. Great. We'll stay. Miss Tusk! Miss Tusk! Anything! No. Yes. Trap door. Open it. Savvy sake, man. Get down here. Give me a hand. It's all right, Wibbly. I've done it. Wibbly. Wibbly. As you will see, we have constructed the most barbaric yet ingenious form of death. Oh! <laughs> Put it over there, boys. <laughs> the death of a thousand screams. Nice name. It peels people. <laughs> Clever. And not just people. Potatoes, parsnips, onions. Your basic veg. Carrots, sprouts. Fruit. Anything from your basic grape to your exotic mango. Well, could it core an apple? With ease, young sir. A oh, Christopher me, a peeled apple with the core still in it. I know exactly what you mean. Look, will you two just belt up? I want to hear the agonized screams of a dying woman, not the dribbling rantings of fools. Sorry. Proceed with the sacrifice. <laughs> it is without doubt an unholy form of death. Can it dice think? Oh! <laughs> Where's Jackson Face now? Right here. Yeah. Hey, Jackson! Jackson Face, actually, at your service. <laughs> Wibber's the machine. Yeah. Smart, isn't it? I'll do one for the kitchen. You can pour an apple. Oh, a nice veg. Oh, oh, yeah. Jackson, I can't get free. I'm gonna die! You're being hysterical. I'm gonna I'm down. Woman. I always knew we should never have brought you along. Oh. Try 
Pinch me, Wibbly. I'm dreamy. Oh! Yeah, well, you got nice pinch me. Oh. oh, dare you, Wibbly. Who knows what wonders await? We'll take it from here. <laughs> Watch them! I'm looking forward to dealing with you later, Mr. Jackson. Oops, I've cocked it up again. Pace. <laughs> At last, the treasure of Kinard is mine. Mine! Mine! <laughs> Sounded a bit suspect, didn't it, eh? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, well, that's it. I think we should call it a day and go on, mate. Wibbly, I have not come this far to give up now. Don't be a fool, Jackson. Only an absolute idiot would go in there. You're right, of course. Thank you. After you. You what? Hey? No. 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 The treasure chamber of Kinar. Ain't much to shout about, is it, eh? They've had me guarding this for a thousand years. I saw you coming, mate. Ah, nobody makes a fool of it. Welcome on board. On board what? There is nothing to fear. Please, follow the light. What about the others? They were not suitable for my purpose. Too greedy. Foolish, stupid. I have simply transported them, given them a new destiny, a suitable purpose. Please, follow the light. Wibbly. Here's tomorrow's horoscope. Philo. Hello, Philo. 
Hello. Polly, I hope you're being nice to Philo. Who's a pretty boy, then? Oh, don't even think about it! Uh, with the sudden, unexplained disappearance of Rivita Tusk, I have been given the job of reporter on a very important newspaper. So don't expect me back in Kennard for many years. I have my own humble secretary, who I enjoy treating badly, and an enormous... How do you spell enormous? It should be on the label inside your blouse. Thank you. And have those letters ready for me to sign before lunch. Anything you say, boss. Do you have questions? What happened to the treasure? Have we died and gone somewhere the Bible forgot to mention? Many thousands of years ago, when I landed on your planet, a great tribe thought me a god. They constructed the Temple of Kinard around me. I knew that one day, the bravest, the most resourceful of your species would come. Pilot me, please. Where? I have a mission, a cause. I must travel beyond the planets, beyond space itself, beyond your imagination. Pilot me, please. Whitley? Sounds like a lot, doesn't it? Uh, what sort of mission? lady said, what sort of mission? Pilot me. Do you honestly think that we would be idiot enough to risk our lives for an unknown cause, in an unknown craft, in unknown parts of space? Yes. So do I. Pace in space. I'd really rather like the sound of it. Wibbers, Miss Tuff! Tuff! 